In this video, I'm gonna show you how to make a 3D book mockup using Canva. So I'm inside of my Canva account, and the first thing we need to do is create a design file for our book cover design, which we can then upload to the 3D mockup tool, which is also in Canva. So I'm in uh, the homepage here. I'm gonna search for book cover. I'm gonna click on templates, and we'll see that Canva provides a bunch of different templated categories to choose from related to book covers. So if I just select the first one, we'll see that Canva provides a bunch of different template designs which we can click on. And what that does is create a new design file in our Canva account. From here, we can just change the text. Uh, we can change the font. We can change the color of the font and do all sorts of stuff. Now, let's say we don't like this particular design. We're gonna go back here and I'm gonna go back to the search and we'll see that Canva has actually broken down these book cover designs into different categories. So if we select Thriller book covers, you can see this is kind of in a similar style to what you might see on a like a fiction book. Let's take a look through the science fiction covers. So again, there's tons of different templates that you can choose. You can also just start from scratch, which is a good option as well. But there's so many templates that it's probably a good place to just get some inspiration and start your design. So I'm going to select this one here. And maybe I want to change the color of this. Now let's say I'm happy with this design. What I'm gonna do next is click on download, select the file type, and then download as either a PNG or a JPEG. In this case, I'm just gonna choose JPEG because it's a smaller file size, and then uh, select download. So that file is now being downloaded to my desktop, and the next thing I'm gonna do is create a new page, and I'm going to go to uploads. I'm gonna click on upload media, and select that file from my desktop, and then click onto it. And so the reason we're doing it this way and the reason that we can't use this page here is because these are all individual elements. And in order to create a 3D mockup using Canva's mockup tool, we need just a single image. So that's why we need to design the file first, download it, and then re-upload it to Canva. So once we've re-uploaded this into our canvas, we're gonna go to effects and under smart mockups, we're gonna select see all. And these are all of the 3D mockups that Canva provides that we simply click onto and our design file will be added as a mock-up on top of that. So if you scroll toward the bottom here, we have a few different options for creating book mock-ups, including this one here, which is a really nice transparent background 3D book. And so by selecting that, it simply converts my design file into this 3D mock-up, which already looks pretty nice. Now, if I click onto this icon here, we can change how it's cropped on top of this uh, mock-up in case we don't like how it looks. So right now it's set to fill. If I select fit, you'll see it kind of changed the way that it mocks up on top of this book. I can also select custom and just change the size and the position manually. I can also select object color and you'll see that just changes the color of the book itself. I like the look of the white one and I like the look of fit. We're gonna click apply and it's really as simple as that. Now we have our 3D book mockup. So from here, we can click on download. And in this case, I would recommend choosing PNG because PNGs have a transparent background if we select this checkbox here. And then I'm gonna select this and say only page two. I don't care about that first page. Done, download. And so now we have this 3D book mockup with a transparent background that we can now use in a landing page or perhaps in an ad campaign or anywhere else really. So I'm inside of a landing page building tool here. And I'm just gonna show you how you can use this on your landing page. So I'm gonna select this image, click on browse. I've uploaded this file into my account. So I'm just gonna select this image and you'll see it adds a nice looking 3D, pretty realistic looking book onto this landing page. But there are a couple different book mockups that you can use in Canva. If I click on new page, I'm gonna add this design file back into my canvas, click on effects, go to smart mockups and Here's another example, which looks kind of nice. So this is an option that you could use as well. Doesn't look like it's cropped perfectly. So I'm gonna select this one. That looks a bit better. Uh, so that's a pretty nice looking one as well. If I go to effects, we'll take a look at one of the other ones as well. So in this case, this is more of a uh, photo style. It's not gonna be as useful for applying on a landing page like this one here. But it still creates a pretty realistic looking mock-up of a book. 
There is another way that you can create a 3D mockup. If you go to elements and search for frames, all of these frames are elements where if we just drag an image or a video on top of it, it just crops to that dimension. And so there is a frame in the shape of a 3D book. And so if I drag my design file onto this, we can see we get a 3D book mockup as well. But you'll notice that the design file that we dragged on top doesn't shape to the 3D dimensions of this mockup design, nor does this book look very realistic anyways. So the smart mockups feature is actually a relatively new feature. And as you can see, the quality is quite a bit higher. So I definitely recommend using those. Everything I showed you in today's video is actually available on Canvas free plan. But if you're curious to try Canvas Pro Plan, I have an affiliate link in the description for you to get a free 30-day trial. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.